How you guys doing? Chris Ignato here, and uh, well, this video is about fall. I mean, it's here in full swing. Beautiful. It might be my favorite time of the year. I mean, look at all these colors. You know, you got all the leaves and those aromas on the air and everything. <sighs> I'm not going to talk about pumpkin spice cream cheese or pumpkin spice coffee or air freshener or any of those things. Um, although I got to say, I love Halloween. But uh, come along and uh, let's see some of the things that make fall, fall. Hope you enjoy. Well, fall is an awesome time of the year. I love it so much. It's that time where all the leaves begin to change. The trees suck the water out of the leaves back down into the roots. It keeps the trees from dehydrating, but it causes those tannins to change colors when the temperatures drop, giving you an awesome palette of fire. Reds, oranges, yellows, even pink are just some of the colors giving the landscape flair from horizon to horizon. The trees also give us plenty of nuts like acorns and walnuts and hickory nuts. Lots of food to get you through the winter. The squirrels know this. So do many other animals, including myself. Now there's still plenty of fruit available too. Grapes are still on their vines. Pawpaws are finishing their cycle. There's apples abundant. And the persimmons are just about ready to eat. They're really good. They taste just like jam when you spread them across toast. Really good and sweet. And there you have the squirrels jumping all over the place in a frantic fury to grab the last acorn and bury it before some other squirrel gets it. The sun sets early, but it gives the sky a brilliant dance of color and light. The blue skies are far richer, especially contrasting with those orange leaves on the trees. Uh, fall is also one of my favorite times to go camping because you get to toast that fire up nice and warm and then sit down with some hot chocolate. And you get to listen to all the crickets and katydids dids and coneheads singing away. I mean, just listen. They sound awesome. And then when they're done, you get the owls and the foxes. They're calling away and sometimes even a whippoorwill. Hear that, guys? I want you to try to guess what that is. Now in early fall you get a lot of mantises and wasps and bees and beetles and everything else. And as fall grows older, you're pretty much left with moths. Geese are meeting and flocking by the thousands, coming and going from the lakes and rivers and ponds, talking up a storm like a whole bunch of people at a family reunion. We mustn't forget the deer, of course. Interesting thing about them is the same time that it's hunting season for deer happens to be the same time that their fur perfectly matches the landscape that they're found in. Now if you spent much time going about in the fall, there's one thing you're going to remember. The spiders. The orb weavers really represent themselves in the fall. You get those beautiful webs looking like a broken pane of glass with some pretty big spiders in them. In fact, stop by a bridge at this time of year and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. Isn't this beautiful? Look at all these colors. Now, normally in the summer, all the leaves are green, okay, because of the chlorophyll. All those chloroplasts are at work. However, the oranges and yellows from the carotenoids are always present. But when it gets cold, those chloroplasts shut down. So the green goes away and you're left with these brilliant oranges and yellows. However, in the fall, you also see a lot of reds and purples showing up, but those aren't present throughout the rest of the year. Those are due to the anthocyanins, okay? And what happens as the sugars start to break down, you get those beautiful reds and purples showing up in the leaves. Another brilliant thing in the fall. I love it. So what do y'all think? False is great, isn't it? Now, something I can't quite capture on film is that delicious aroma you get across the air. 
know, the smell of campfires and fireplaces burning, the tannins in all the leaves, the rich leaf hummus in the soil. There's so many fragrances in the fall that are just beautiful. And then you got the temperatures. I mean, right now it's low 70s. It's going to get pretty cold and crisp tonight, but I just love it. Fall is a wonderful time, and I'm sure some of you agree with me. Uh, anyhow, once again, I'm Chris Ignato. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Signing out.